so excited about just because I've had so many requests for it and this is probably the most requested video right now and the most asked about is if I would film a dorm tour. So today is my dorm tour video and I'm so excited to share this with you all. I love it so much. I've been here for a few days now. That's why I've kind of not been posting that many videos. I've just been pretty busy just getting used to everything but I'm so excited to get this video up. So I'm not going to talk too much just because I don't know how long this is going to be but this is my full dorm tour and I hope you guys enjoy. Okay guys so this is the outside of our door. These are our name tags. Um, I just put some washi over the room number just for privacy reasons. So as you go into the room, I'm trying to be kind of quiet because there's people on my floor. This is what you see when you walk in. This is my side and this is my roommate Haley's side. And so I'm just going to do a little overview really quick. As you walk into our room, we have this really cute rug um, that I painted that says you're like really pretty. And then we also have a rug in the middle of our floor and it's just like a fuzzy cream colored rug. And then we, and then we each have rugs under our desk in the same color scheme. Hers is like a pale coral and cream like triangles and mine is more like a kind of like a quarter foil pattern and we both have those with our just our house shoes and stuff like that just to make everything a little bit more comfortable. Okay so this is my side and I'm mostly going to go in depth on it. I'm not really going to go into my roommate side too much just because you know that's her personal area but I thought um just really quick I would show like the side of the wall that you can't see from the front of the room this is my corner it's just got my armoire in it so there's an overview of that I'm just gonna start over here and we have this mirror and this light and both of those came with the room um, just cleaning supplies and stuff like that up there I put two over-the-door hooks on my wardrobe right there and just hung my bathrobe and my towel and then I have a over the door mirror that we just used command strips to put on and then down in the bottom of my armoire is two drawers so this is the inside of the armoire you'll see that it goes to there and then we have two drawers in the bottom so what I have in here is just on this top shelf up here I have my deodorant um, body splashes lotion things like that and then in these two sets of drawers I have like hair ties headbands and just anything like that for my hair and then on this, I don't really have that many clothes that I have hung up. Most of my clothes are folded and in drawers. But I have my raincoat. I have this accessory rack that has all my scarves and then like baseball hats and stuff over the top of it. And then I have all my clothing just on the velvet like huggable hangers. Down here in the bottom, I have both of my shower caddies. I'll link the video where I talk in depth about what I have in my shower caddies down below. So I have both of those there, and then I also just have some pajamas. And then in this top drawer, if I can get it open, I just have all of my hair appliances and um, stuff like that in here. And then this is actually all the makeup that I brought, so I'm like really proud of that. I have all my makeup, my makeup brushes, um, my jewelry holder, some sunscreen that's really all in this drawer just because we actually do have a lot of storage space and then in this bottom drawer I just have jeans and some sweatpants I really don't have that much in these drawers okay so that's it for what's in my wardrobe on the side here we just have this little key hook where we have both of our lanyards and our dorm keys and car keys and then down below I have a little coral bucket I've showed this in I think my dorm hall part one where I just have all of my tennis shoes and stuff like that and then I also have my book bag sitting there and my umbrella and then the back of our door looks like this um, those are the pom-pom balls that I showed in one of my dorm halls we actually have them had them on the ceiling and they just kept falling off so we just clipped them up there for right now above our door we just have a wall cling that says keep calm and carry on and I got that at Walmart and then we have all of our magnets and like um, magnetized post-it note things and stuff like that and we also have a calendar that has both of our schedules on it just so that we can keep up with each other okay so I'm gonna go ahead and show you all my desk and my bedding um, I just have my own chair that I actually brought this is just like a normal office rolly chair and I have that quilt on it that I said that my boyfriend had given me and then I have a couple bags and stuff hanging here on my towel hook and then for my desk um, 
really just kind of essential things. It's not like super decorative. I have a thing here that holds all my folders for my classes. I just have this pineapple cup because it's cute. There's actually nothing in it. And then I have um, Germex, stuff like that. In this, um, some post-it notes, page flags, and th things like that. My calculators and stuff like that in a clear organizer. And this came from Walmart. And it's sitting on two books that have like the gold trim that are just really pretty. And both of those are from um, Marshalls and like TJ Maxx and places like that. Then I have the three mason jars that I painted. And I have them sitting in a Lily Pulitzer tray that came with um, an iPad case that I bought. I just thought it was pretty. So I put those in there and I have my pens and pencils, highlighters and stuff like that. Then there is my little mirror that I use to get ready in the mornings. And I also have my desk lamp with my monogram on it that I showed you all. In that, I just have my cell phone charger plugged in, uh, my cell phone, a zip drive, and my memory card adapter. And then I also have my cords um, put on my table with these little things. You can buy these at Target. I ordered them off of an app that I talked about in my dorm hall part two. All those videos will be linked below. But I just have this to hold my cords. And then I have my laptop with all my cute stickers on it. And my Lily agenda. For the desk drawers, I'm just gonna show a couple of them just cause there's not anything really special in them. In this top drawer, I just have two organizers. And this one um, right here, I just have like some um, ties and stuff like that for chip bags and my beauty blender and then I have this with nothing in it it's just sitting there I also have some golden white file folders and my iPad mini and then I'm not gonna go through this drawer just because there's just more personal things in it but this bottom drawer just has my books and some veggie straws back there that I was eating also some flashcards then over on my wall, I have this um, cork board, and these come on the walls in the dorm that we're in. So I just have all kinds of pictures on it, and I also have um, those lights with the little paper like globes around them. I hung my K up there with both of my little canvases on the side, and my little deer is just chilling right here with some headbands and stuff like that on it. And then onto my bed, this is what it looks like. You can see I still have a couple of the um, little paper like tissue balls holding on up there, but I did have more, but they fell, it fell off. So this is what my bed looks like. You all have seen my bedding in all of the other videos. The quilt is from Marshalls. This comforter on the end here is from Big Lots. And um, this throw is from TJ Maxx, as well as that pillow that says hit snooze. This pillow right here um, came with the comforter set and I just put the Kentucky and the trim on it. I ordered this monogram pillow from Etsy and I painted the Lily Pulitzer one. And then I just have like a um, larger pillow back here like to lean against when I'm doing homework or anything like that. And then um, the fabric on my headboard, I don't think I've mentioned that, is from Hobby Lobby. And we just made the headboards ourselves. So that's really it for my bedding. And then underneath my bed, I do have a lot of storage because it is up higher. So down here, I just have my hamper. I have a couple of totes. This first one has all kinds of food and snacks and stuff like that in it that don't need to be in the refrigerator. So I have K-Cups, um, Pop-Tarts, just things like that. This next one has all of my towels and washcloths. And then I have my two sets of drawers. This top one just has underwear and socks. This one has like pajamas. This one kind of has like workout type of clothing. Next one has underwear and stuff as well. This one is all leggings. Literally the whole drawer is leggings. And this bottom one is pajamas. Then I have this little step stool that I just keep so that I can get on my bed a little bit easier. Then I also have this tub where I put my pillows when I'm turning my bed down at night. But right now it just has some bottled water that wouldn't fit in our refrigerator. Then I also just have that gold step ladder propped up right here. Then this is our window and it's really pretty. This is probably one of my favorite parts of our room. Our curtains are actually from the Family Dollar. And I don't know that you'll be able to see the details of them. I'll try to like get up close here. They're like a sheer white with a really pretty gold design on them. And um, that banner is from Hobby Lobby. Then this is our nightstand that also has our refrigerator. 
So on the nightstand, I just have um, a little clip-on fan plugged in just to give me some air in the middle of the night and also gives a little bit of noise. I have this picture frame with a picture of Dean and I and the frame is from Marshalls. I have my alarm clock. I have this mug that says I woke up like this. I think that's so cute. And then I also have this little macaroon trinket box and a lamp. The lamp and the shade are from the Dollar General. So that is pretty much everything on my side. And then we have a tart warmer back here. And um, we also have this little bucket. This is my roommate's apples. We just filled it with the apples. I think it's really cute. She has her little macaroon box. And then she painted this face. And it says stop and smell the roses. But instead of flowers right now, we actually just have one of those pom-pom things like halfway unfolded. It's just a little make-do flower vase for now. Um, then on down here is our refrigerator, and on this side we have all of our cups. We have a um, water pitcher with a filter, and then we have um, mugs, turvis cups, bottles, and just stuff like that. And then this is the refrigerator that she painted. I did show a picture of it. It's just so cute. So then when you open up our refrigerator, we actually have a lot of stuff right now. Um, we have some water and some baby bell cheeses in the door. Then we just have ice cubes and stuff like that up here. Uh, this top shelf is mostly my stuff. I just went ahead and made some salads in like Tupperware bowls. And then I have apple slices and some hummus. And then this is also one of my salad bowls down here because it wouldn't fit. And then she has like yogurt, um, some grapes, all kinds of fruit. Um, down here she also has salad stuff, some naked drinks, and more fruit and things like that. So we're trying to stay healthy. Um, if y'all have any tips for easy recipes for the dorm that are kind of healthy, please let us know because we're kind of having a hard time storing healthy food. It's a little bit more difficult than we thought it would be. And then down below here we have two totes. Her dad actually built this piece of furniture that all this is sitting on. It's just a white like cabinet that holds the refrigerator perfectly and he built it so that we could put um, these two totes down here and store stuff. In this first one, we just have paper plates, napkins, um, like plastic utensils, and cups. And then in this one, we have paper towels, some Ziploc bags, um, she has some K-cups, and just other things like that in that part. And then this is my roommate's side. She gave me permission um, to show you like um, an overview of her stuff. Her headboard, the fabric, is also from Hobby Lobby, and we just made those together. And then she made... Um, this little pom-pom thing is so cute. She made that by herself just out of like white yarn. Then she has this really pretty quilt on her bed that goes with our color scheme really well. And that's from Walmart as well as the pillow sham. This pineapple pillow was one that she painted when I painted the Lily Pulitzer one. And then she also has a turquoise like fuzzy pillow. On this part of her wall, we have, she has three picture frames and um, she painted the little Kentucky picture right here. And then we also just have this pineapple that has our TV channels on it because we can never remember the TV channels. She also has the same letter hanging on her wall with like pearls hanging over top of it, which is really cute. And then she also has the cork board with pictures and stuff like that on it. On her desk, she just kind of has the same stuff as mine computer and then her desk also has the cure egg on it just because we don't have like a lot of places to sit stuff like that and then um her wardrobe is actually turned differently than mine and that is just so that we can fit the tv on top of it so we have our tv up there and she has her mirror and robe and stuff like that hanging on her door with her shoes and shower caddy and things like that underneath and then out here back around to the door so that was my dorm tour i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please give it a thumbs up as always i would really appreciate it if you would share this video and comment and subscribe and i hope you guys enjoy this thanks for watching